Hey guys, I'm sorry I haven't made a video lately. I've just been real busy with work and I've been helping with youth wrestling coaching. So I'm here at work and I've decided to make my intro so I can put this video out for you guys. So hopefully this is the first annual, but I don't know how well it's gonna go, but welcome to the Delashment Road Car Show. First up are my guys from Rust Bucket Redemption. And as you can see, he's redoing a 59 Etzel, and I sure do miss those days. A couple things different about our cars is he has a 292, and I have two more doors. And as you can see here, it's ready for paint, and I sure can't wait to see it. And he does have another car. It's this is a Dodge Neon, and he two-toned it and slapped some white walls on it. So if you guys get a chance, go check out their channel at Rust Bucket Redemption. Next up is my Uncle Dave and his 68 Chevelle. Right now it's a project and my Uncle Dave sure loves his projects. And right here are some projects of his from his channel which is Dave's Workshop Projects. Go check out his channel, it's brand new. Now check out this bathing beauty. Now this is Gerald Brown 1968 Impala. It was a one owner car with 55,000 original miles. He is also building a tribute car to the TV show Supernatural. I can't wait until I'm back in Tennessee so I could have a chance to look him up. But for the time being, I'll just watch him on YouTube at Gerald Brown. And this is my buddy Kirk's Triumph and I just absolutely love that retro look. The next couple of cars is owned by R.J. McGregor, and this Edsel that you just saw, he painted himself. I was going to try to paint mine, but I lost my paint roller. Man, does this dude have some sweet cars. I think this is my favorite out of all of his cars. The next set of cars are from Bill McCaskill. Now that's a family photo. And this is Rick Hoffmeister's 1958 Etzel. This is a one owner car with low miles and hasn't been on the road for 40 years. He does plan on getting it back on the road this summer. Next group of cars are from the guys from Etzel Quarterly. I first learned about the Etzel Quarterly at the International Etzel Car Club Show at Dayton, Ohio. So I had the chance to meet the editor of Etzel Quarterly at the show while checking out his beautiful 1960 Etzel. And if you guys love Etzels as much as I do, go check out Etzel Cordley on Facebook. They have a bunch of content in the world of Etzel. Now check out this deal. This is Nelson Heddle's 1960 Etzel that he bought for $15. Yeah, you heard me right, $15. He found this in someone's front lawn while kids used it as a slide. It originally had a six cylinder, but the camshaft broke so he replaced it with a 59 Etzel's V8. And now you can't even get a model for $15. Speaking about models, 
Here's one that he recently built. This is his 58 Dragster. Here's some bonus memorabilia from Etzel Cordley. And what would a car show be on Delashment Road Car Show without Howard from Old Car Alley? And here's his 1959 Chevy Bel Air. He recently got another project car. You guys should go check it out on his YouTube channel. And last but certainly not least, and here's a picture of a, my good friend's Riviera. George recently passed away and we sure do miss him and George this video is dedicated to you my friend